Hello viewers, this is Cynthia Michael from Screw Reviews, bringing you a new podcast from my subject called The Vorto Review. And like always, I'm going to speak very loudly, very clearly, and very slowly, in case you don't understand me. Also, I'll try to do my best not to preach your heart during, <laughs> during this audio podcast recording as well, not to cause any audio feedback as well. And finally, uh, and finally, if you're under 18, this audio podcast recording will attain to adult language. Now, once again, if you're under 18, this audio podcast recording will have some adult language. So anyway, let's get into the latest episode of Borto. So, firstly, I know I'm like doing this review right now. It, mm. Other things had came up, so basically, once again, I'm sorry for the late review on Barto. You know, I had something else to do today, so basically, I didn't get the chance to watch the episode. The episode today, you know, I didn't get the chance to watch the episode, so basically, sorry for the late review. So anyway, let's go. Let's go. This episode. So basically, this I'm gonna try to keep this short and to try to keep this review short and get to the point of this episode. So basically, we see. <laughs> We see Borto and Mishki uh, on a ship heading to heading towards uh, uh, how how we how we to heading towards Home Circle Castle, a prison. Now, if you're not familiar with Home Circle Castle, I if I'm saying the name wrong, please forgive me. You know, Home Circle Home Circle Castle in the world of Naruto, which is what this what this trip what this massive security prison in in the land of grass. But things had changed over the years you now, and, and but we're in the Borto areas. To things Home Circle the castle prison is not no longer a supermax prison, it's just now a, you know, just an average, you know, it's just, it's an average prison for only for, only for Shinobis, people who, people, only for Shinobis and shit like that. So anyway, it turns out the reason why, why Mishki, why Mishki and Borto were, were going to, 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 to prison in the first place because there's a, there's a situation going on, so basically they're on a special mission to, to help this name, name to help this uh, or a special mission. Turns out this mission has got to do with the mo with the Moji gang. So basically this 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 been this gang who's been causing a lot of trouble around around the land of fire. So basically, you know so basically, you know so basically so basically the, like a lot of Marvel forces in the hidden leaf and you know in the land of fire, including ninjas are trying to figure out who is the gang leader the Moji Gang. So basically, this gang called the Moji Gang has been causing a lot of problems around the land of fire. So basically, so basically, so basically, they figure if they can, if they can, if they can get to the leader, you know, they can dismantle the Moji Gang once and for all. But, but the, nobody, nobody knows who is who is the boss of the Moji Gang. So basically, it turns out, turns out that you no, know, it turned out in the and and Borto, you know, during you might miss a briefing, you know, Naruto. Naruto was t- during the Nifty Britain with Naruto's house, Sa- Sarada, Mishiki, and Borto. That you know, this this is named named Kadawu, who named Kadawu, Kadawu, who is a ex member of the gang who got arrested, got arrested, and and was sent to Hosuki to Hosuki Castle Prison. So basically, you know, so basically, we need to make sure he said he claims he has information, you know. He you know, and so basically he claims he has information about about the gang and party gang leader. So basically, you know, but there's a there's a problem with that. There's a problem that you know. It turns out that the second of the the second the second of I mean, the second of the I mean. The second in command of the Moji Gang was since a week ago. The, the, the second, uh, the second commander of the gang was sent to prison at at Hozuki at at Hozuki Prison. So basically, so basically, the second man was sent turned out a week ago. And, and the guy, the second in command of the Ho, Hozuki Gang, was sent to the same prison after uh, as Kadaru, who is Kadaru, who So basically. 
so the, so basically his life is in danger. So basically the set the rumor is that you know going from from Carlos Intel like you know this guy will will kill me who will kill who will kill who will try to kill him who will try to kill him if he if he tries to leak any information about the gang and also Carlos stole some money to the gate also. So basically you know so basically the second man of the the second, the second major, major lieutenant of the gang is is in the same prison as Carlo, you know, and Carl and Carlo wants to kill him for you know for stealing the gang's money and whatnot. So basically, you know, so basically, you know, Naruto and Boruto and Michigan as prisoners to to attack Carlo and make sure that you know he's on the level. So basically, that's the reason why why Boruto and Miski were, you know, was, you know, or in the prison, posting as prisoners. Now, now, as the only person who knows that the, knows that Borto and and Miski are are ninjas are uh, is the he, is the Lord of the prison named Mo Mo Moji Moji Moji. So basically, the, so basically, the head of the prison, Lord Moji Moji, is the, is the only person at the prison that, you know, that knows that Boruto and Boruto and Miki are are there in the sky to carry out a mission. As for Shrada, she's there as a journalist to make sure that, you know, make sure to keep the eye of the guards in case, you know, in case, you know, they're working for the Moji gang. For the, for the, I mean, for the, for the, for the Moji gang. For the Moji gang. So basically, like Shrada, so basically Boruto and Mishi are prisoners are posing as prisoners and Sarada is posing as a as a young as a young new footballer at the prison and shit like that. So anyway so in my Boruto, so basically Boruto and Miski got, you know, with, you know, introduced to their cellmates, so basically it's like, you know, mm -hmm. so basically it's like, it's six for, so basically at, at the prison it's like, you know, you know, one, one prison house, you, or one, uh, one cell has, house, you like six people, so basically Boruto and Miski were introduced to their, you know, to their, you know, prison mates and shit like that, blah, 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 so basically, you know, when they went to go get something to eat. No, Boruto was asking, you, have you seen a guy named Karu? Who is Karu? So basically, like, you know, and so basically, we're running, so basically, Boruto was asking, asking one of his prison mates, you know, have you seen a guy named Karu? So basically, his prison mate said that, oh, what the, the second, uh, the, the second, you know, the, the one, the, the second, you know, to basically, you know, the second, uh, the second, you know, from, from you know, uh, the one of the, uh, the, the second commander of the Mo of the Moji gang tried tried to attack to attack Karu and send him to the hospital, but you know, and send him to the hospital. So basically, to the to the prison hospital. So basically, it turns out that you know that the that the the second of the the second commander of the Moji gang had sent Karu to the hospital ward and. And once he did that, you know, he got locked into solitary. So basically, so basically, Boruto was like, you know, we need to get into the hospital and you know, try to talk to, try to talk to him. But Boruto, but Boruto and Miki prisonate in prison, in prison, you know, you know, cellmate, tell me that you guys, it's not easy to get, get, get into the hospital ward. So basically, that you, you. You better, the only way you get into the hospital was unless you're very sick or, 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 or very hurt. So basically, like, you know, that's the only way you get into the prison ward. Into the, in the, in the prison, into, into the prison ward. So basically, into the hospital ward of the prison. So basically, the prison, so basically, when they went out to the yard for rec time, like, you know, their cellmate was telling, telling there's a special, there's a Special, uh, there's a special food, 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 uh, food uh, behind this, behind this, that goes around here. So basically, you know, you know, you can use it to, you know, to fake a, fake 
food poisoning. So basically, you know, their cellmate told them there's a special fruit that can, you know, that can give you temporary food poisoning and shit like that. So basically, Mishki, so basically, Mishki used for his strength to get one of the fruits, the fruits, and Bartos took it, he took it, you know, and got sick, and went to the hospital ward. So basically, Bartos was passed out to the day, and he, he met up with Kalu, and Kalu thought Bartos was a, was sent by the Moji gang to kill him, but Bartos proved, proved himself that he's not a, you know, like, you know, he's not, you know, he's not, you know, and both have to prove themselves to Kotaru that he's not a, you know, not a hitman sent by the most he can to kill him. So anyway, so basically, like, you know, Boto, so basically Boto's mission was to make sure that, that Kotaru is on the level. So basically, like, you know, like, you know, so basically, do you know, like, you know, I will, if you can help me, I'll tell you anything you want to know about the Moji game. So basically, you know, if you can help me get out of there, I'll tell you anything. And I'll still take me to the Moji gang who's trying to kill me in this prison. So thank you for to say, like, don't worry. Well, I'll make sure that you, that you, that you are white right and try to get you out of here somehow. So anyway, when Borto, basically, you know, Borto was feeling better and the guards, and the guards who was taking him back, the, the, the doctor and the guards were taking him, taking him back to his cell, but out of nowhere, a out of nowhere, out of nowhere, a assassin, a, a, a a prisoner tried to, I'm no prisoner tried to kill Kotaru, uh, and, uh, but, you know, but, but Kotaru just ended up, ended up just getting injured, but, then, you know, so basically, Boruto and the guards rushed back. To see that, to see what happened to Carlo, but lucky for Carlo, you know, he just got he just got injured in the arm, he just got cut in the arm and shit like that. So anyway, so anyway, the boy, so basically like, so the episode ended with the unknown prisoner that was sent by the second, uh, the, the second. Uh, the second commander of the Bogey gang to kill Kotaro for stealing their money and also assigns him to talk to give him any information about about the Bogey gang and shit. So basically the episode ended with with the uh, with the prisoner assassin who was you know, who, you know, who was run away who run away after after almost trying to kill Kotaro and that's how the episode ended. So basically I just kept this episode Sure. So basically, this episode, this is, this is a solid good episode for the story about the Moji gang. So basically, this was a good episode. So anyway, so anyway I just had to, you know, I'm just going to keep this review short and whatnot. So anyway, this was a good solid first episode of the Moji of the Moji gang story arc for for for, for Boruto for the Boruto anime series. So anyway, what do you guys think about this about this first episode? So for the whole Moji, the whole Moji gang story out for for for, for the Boruto series. Was it good? Was it bad? Or was it just okay? Please let me know what the comments below this podcast. So anyway, like always, like always, this Cynthia Michael from Screw Review signing off. One.